All right, hey guys, today we are here back in one second, back in Roblox for Spook Blocks, and uh, I have a costume today, guys. I wore it uh, last video, but not the entire time. So this, this is going to be my costume for the entire video, and it's really hard to see out of, and also it's very annoying to, to use, but you know... I'm using it, all right, for you guys. So, uh, hey, I got the Halloween border back, by the way. I'm, I'm glad about that. Oh, I may I can make my ring light orange for Halloween. Mo. Boom. Actually, it is kind of orange, isn't it? That's orange right there. I know it's hard for you guys to tell, but it kind of gives off that orange Halloween vibe, if you know what I mean. It's hard to breathe in this thing. Okay. Here we go. Today we're doing the Halloween Obby, and, uh, yeah. Wait, I wonder if there's music. <laughs> da. Not much, to bring her down. Alright. You have to jump on them, lady. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Oh. On to the ghosts. So where are we right now? A haunted house? And what are these spider webs? Uh, what is this? Like, space? Oh, it's planked with nails in it. That makes no sense. Through the door. And now we're in a graveyard. Oh, they got a bit lazy with a roof up there, didn't they? So I'm assuming we just can't touch the graves, right? Yeah. Well, that's this is going to be pretty easy. And this is actually my profile picture, but it's, uh, Halloweenified. I will get something better for the face, don't worry. I will show you the actual avatar soon, though. You gotta jump in here. Oh. Whoa. This is a really long obby, it seems like. Are they, would these be considered pumpkins or jack-o'-lanterns? I think they'd be considered jack-o'-lanterns, but, uh, I don't know. Oh, by the way, guys, I believe I'm going to the pumpkin patch on Saturday, and I'm going to make a video on it, if you guys want, that is. Let me know in the comments. And if I don't get a single comment saying you want it or don't want it, I'm making it. How about you show me you want it with some likes? Yeah. Just just like the video, and if I get any likes, then I'll, I'll do it. Even if I don't get any likes, I'll still do it. But, uh, yeah. Let's continue. Uh, jumping on the chocolate. Not very Halloween related, I mean, if trick-or-treating you'd get chocolate, but, like, is it that Halloween related, though? Oh, God! Oh, 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 yeah. I didn't make it. Okay. Through here. Past the skeletons. Don't. Don't you dare. Spooky, scary skeletons. Shivers down your spine. Shrieking skulls will shock your. Look, y'all know I had to do that. That was a mandatory thing for me to do. Right there. Sing spooky, scary. That, yeah, I had to do that. Like. I didn't just choose, I had to. That was like, that, that's a law, you know? <laughs> it's not a law. We're gonna continue now. Uh, don't even look at the skeletons, because I'm just gonna sing spooky. I'm gonna get myself copyrighted. This is getting hard to breathe in. What are these hitboxes? I'm literally levitating. I guess I am the witch that these cauldrons belong to, because I can float. So, guys, you're gonna need to let me know how on a earth do I make a UGC item without Blender? I don't I don't want to use Blender. First of all, even if I did get Blender, I have no idea how to use it, and I've watched many tutorials on it just for fun, to be honest, and I still have absolutely no clue how to use it. It doesn't make any sense to me, and I don't even want to try to download it, because for all I know, I'm getting a virus trying to download it, which I will, because I suck at downloading things, and also, I just don't want to. I just don't want to use Blender. I just, I feel like it's just way too hard. could possibly get a virus from it. And even if I did disregard all those things, I still can't. I don't have any storage on my laptop. So I just, I just can't do it. The <sighs> baldy, what the? He doesn't, even have, he doesn't even have feet. And look at those fingers. They look like, a, his hand looks like a freaking octopus. Huh. But you guys have to let me know how to make a UGC item without Blender, because I want to have something special planned for you guys. 
with UGC and Roblox, obviously. And, uh, yeah. Hey, is this it's Jason? I'm gonna see his face. Oh, I can't see his face. It looks like he has white eyes under there. Ooh, spooky! Look, this is getting really hard to breathe in, so is it fine if I just, like, do it like this? I don't, I don't know. I guess I'm gonna be, like, a nun with a white thing on the head, you know? This works for a costume, right? We're gonna continue. Why are these, why are there mushrooms? Oh, it's probably for the witch making her concoction in those, uh, cauldrons that we saw earlier. Shop, what's in the shop? I don't got no Robux, but yeah, I don't even have, I don't, I have like what, I think 11 Robux? No. I don't even know why I pressed that. I want to hear some music. Yeah. There's no music? I hear it. Wait. You guys hear that? What is that? I just hear the glitching noises. That's a bit creepy. I mean, this is a Halloween hobby, so that makes sense. <coughs> Originally, I was going to play a two-player Halloween, uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Originally, I was going to play a two-player, uh, Halloween Tycoon with Jeff, but he had to go, so I just did this instead, you know, I guess. Hey, Granny, what are you doing? Huh. The chompers are not in good shape, to be honest. You know, if I would go in trick-or-treating and I open the door, or that someone opened, I don't open the door, I'd say trick or knock and say, or ring the doorbell and say trick-or-treat. Not ordering the doorbell either works. And, uh, they, if they opened it and looked like that, no matter if you have full size candy bars, I am slamming the door and running away. Yeah, your own house, I'm slamming the door and running away. In your face, too. Not my property, but I'm doing it if you look like Granny, okay? I'm sorry, but I ain't accepting candy from some. I'm back here? Oh, you've gotta be kidding me! I'm back at the cauldrons? Did I miss a checkpoint? I missed that checkpoint. Dude, no. Oh, I have to go do Baldy and everything again. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> but back to what I was saying. If I open, if you open the door and your granny, give not candy, holding a baseball bat, I can't jump that. I'm. Not, no, I'm just not even gonna participate. I'm not even gonna participate in that. I'll just be, maybe not slamming the door, but I will be leaving 100%. No doubt about that. Leap. Yeah, I figured that happened. Let's see if I can actually do it though. Yes. Back over the back on the ghost and past the vampires, past Baldy, past Jason. This is fine. Hello, Cabri Brown. That's a weird name. Not very Halloweenified, if I'm gonna be honest. I don't think pink cows are that Halloween related. Unless, unless you're afraid of cows. If you're afraid of cows, then they definitely are. Gotta take this thing off again. Definitely. If you're afraid of cows, then they're very Halloween related. Because Halloween is scary. And if you're, if you think cows are scary, then I guess it's Halloween related. I don't know. Dude, I can't wait. For Halloween. I can't wait for the Bloxburg update, too. They always have the best updates, dude. I cannot wait it. Wait it. Oh, and a Fortnite, Fort Nightmares, the Fortnite update for Halloween. <laughs> they always do a good job. Remember last year? Was it last year? Or 2020, 2019? I don't know, but it was really, really good. It was like the shadows. You turn into a ghost. You could get like a, what was it, victory or ghostly royale spooky royale i don't know what it was called but like some like that like shadow royale i think it was or like victory shadow i don't know what it was yes we're back granny but it was really really fun it was way easier to get wind you could level up easier and it was really really good they did a good job i'm making sure i got that i did but i'll just double check yeah i'll, I'll, I'll double check again if i wanted but uh we're gonna continue now uh Finally, we're back where we left off. This is not very Halloween related. A giant fun rainbow is more like carnival related, not very Halloween-y. Unless you're like talking about the candy. Unless it's the colors of like colorful like Skittles, like this, or M&M's. 
or racy species or something. If they're that, then I guess it's fine. Okay, so we're jumping on cow poop right now, and we're good. I guess these cows. That's where I died last time. These cows are getting walking. They're walking directly into the UFO. These cows are stupid. Hey, I guess cows are Halloween related. <laughs> okay, but here we go. Because they have they have udders. It looks like a pig. Was <laughs> still sick. The cow udders look like a pig coming out of its stomach. It's giving birth to a pig, and its head is still emerged. That's what their udders look like. These are actually not cows. These are bulls, and they're very hypnotized. And they have nose rings, apparently. But the way I can tell they're bulls is because they have massive horns. Come on. Shouldn't those horns be technically killing me, though? I feel like they should be. I don't know. Maybe that's just me thinking that. I want to, uh, for Halloween, I want to dress as a, a character from Stranger Things. I mean, I they have both wanted to, and go together as Stranger Things people. I wanted to be the Demogorgon or Vecna, but turns out they have no good Demogorgon costumes, and the Vecna masks, they look good, but I guarantee the second that we order them, because you can't find them in stores, we order them, and they get here, and I try them on. Is that a smiley face and a ghost? I don't know. But if I try them on, they're probably not even going to fit, and even if they do, they're not going to fit properly. It's not going to be like tight perfect, and it's probably just not even gonna be, it won't even look good, I can almost guarantee that, I just bumped to an octopus. Right. Oh, Slenderman's up, that makes sense. That's why I was hearing those glitching sounds, because Slenderman's right here. You're not supposed to look, oh my god! You're not supposed to look at Slenderman, but I'm doing exactly that. I'm looking at Slender Man. Let's turn this back down though. Okay. Look at these guys. Where are their actual head though? Do they just not have a head? Or is it just maybe the pumpkin's their head? I thought they had a jack o' lantern pumpkin on their head. These are some uh, interesting bats. They literally looked up gray ball bat wings and just put this together and called it good. Wee! Oh come on, that slide doesn't... <sighs> hey, how do you... What? I don't know, Kit Kat, Kit Kat April. Finish? We did it! Congratulate! <laughs> no. I won! I can take this thing off! <sighs> Congratulations! That's not what he would sound like. Congratulations! You won! His brother. Whoa! Yes, it's, we gotta get the dark path. The purple, because, you know, it's shadow path. Yeah. Paint yourself. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna make my. This arm purple, and this arm dark black. Look at me. Halloweenified. Uh, I, I'm just gonna put on every single thing that they have. Every last one. Yes, yes, yes. This is a really good Halloween costume I'm getting on now, guys. Look at me. I can see a jack-o'-lantern in there, too. Well, we're going to end it off on the swing. And we will call it good. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to. Come on, put on your mask, Donald. Okay, okay. Get out of here. I don't want you suffocating me again like you did last video. Bye, guys.